into the middle, which Life University wins cleanly. McElroy passes off to his outside centre, who gives it for, and that is a nice ball to the fullback, who gives it out to the winger. And it is a try for Life University. Good cover tackle there by Dion, unfortunately, it was too late. Which puts the score to 11 nil or something. Western Michigan gathers the line out well, going with the first pod, establishing the ball, playing it out. See a lot of interesting things lately with the ball. Not finding touch on that, but misplayed. But life is recovering. You see the support already. Just the way they drop back. And look, holding the ball nice, finds the gap. There is Moneyham again. Moneyham again, cuts it up right through the middle. Finds the gap, had support, but doesn't need it, and scores. 28 to 10, Life University. Ronan trying to get it out wide. Continue to go out wide. Trying to find Chris Burian, but he knocked the ball on. Advantage to Life U, this is Jake McFadden. Time counter moving him. Little rubber kick, moving him on it. Nice open field tackle by Mooneyham. Oh. <laughs> and did we get a did we get a try through Xander Daniel? I believe we did. Counter Mooneyham with the wheels. I believe it was Rourke Struthers trying to clean up the kick. Picked up the ball, turned around, and Mooneyham was right in his face. Years old and he was about 56 years old and ran me over and said you can't run high old young boy and I learned my lesson and it hurt <laughs> so Life University showing uh, some exciting rugby and playing wide open in the waning minute here of the first half and it breaking it open and they're going to score at the close of the half that could be it right there a try from the center. I just got to see his number. We're a little bit far of a distance right now. Connor Mooneyham on the try. Looks like he's got a nice flow going on out there. Nice air bouncing around as he's uh, tearing it up, cutting it up. Arizona has looked very good. They've had success in this tournament. 2015, they lost to Kutztown in the semis and beat Arkansas State in the quarterfinals. The winner of this match gets the three-time defending champion, Cal Bears. That was Cesar Davia, one of the captains for Arizona, and they are close to getting one. A big tackle there made after the ball. 
And watch the quick hands here by Jonah Eldridge. A different Arizona team, Brian. It harkens back to the days four or five years ago when they had some really fast, strong players, players that are now playing for the USA. And coming right back with a nice answer is the running Eagles. Life University with a strong response. Connor Mooneyham with the try, but it all comes from the work of Duncan Van Skalkwick. Watch the little scrum half. He goes quickly, finds space on the corner, tests the defense, gets the bite on the defense, looks back inside. That's a great play by Van Skalkwick. And all Mooneyham has to end a touch for a line out instead. Southley will go himself. Beautiful inside out running. Southley number two. Does he have the strength? Defense is coming. No one running in support, and Southley taken down, and that was a high tackle. Mooneyham goes high, he does all the work, but he goes too high, and the penalty for Arizona. Oh, this could be a yellow card, a penalty advantage. Actually slowing the game down helps life right now, because three players can't get back on defense. They are struggling. You talk about the fatigue on day two. A lot of players walking right now for life. You can't like that if your coach hard to run and suck air and talk at the same time, but that's what you got to do. It actually makes it easier. It just doesn't feel that way. Get up, get up, Dave. Harley. Push, push, Harley. Push. There you go. From life, they don't like it when they don't have quick access to the ball on a penalty. That's what all the raised feathers were about there. Connor Mooningham. It's Arizona. Trying the outside, beautiful tackle, offload, and another. The half has come, it is life on top, 7-5 second half after this.